Hey, I'm out in my garage here. Uh, I can't seem to get out of this damn garage today. I'm so excited, but I wanted to put this video out and uh, just show you guys because you guys have heard for so long that I'm going to do a rebuild. And uh, I'm not one to talk shit, so I just wanted to show you guys something. Um, also, you might be wondering why I don't have my hat on. I always wear a Plan B hat, and uh, I'm going to show you why right now it's not on my head. Uh, I got a big ass head. My head is a seven and seven eighths. I, it's pretty damn big uh, cranium up there, but I'm gonna show you something here. There's my plan B hat. There isn't just one. There's four of them bad boys. These are not 15s. Signed, sealed, delivered, baby. Four SMD 18s and uh, just wanted to show you guys that you know I wasn't playing around uh, my Silverado is still up for sale uh, actually I just got it paid off I just went ahead and, uh, and paid the remainder of what I owed on it so the titles in the mail um, as we speak it might even show up today I don't know but uh, as soon as it does I got quite a few bites on this thing uh, this truck is a really sound truck for those of you who don't know or haven't heard this truck, uh, it's very good running, very loud truck. Uh, there's two alternators, four kinetic 1800 batteries, 16 interior speakers up front. Uh, pretty much just a Kenwood Exelon uh, head unit. Four 15s walled off, two big ass amps. Uh, one for the mids and highs, one for the subs. We're tuned at 37. Uh, yeah, there's the mail right there. Hopefully she's here today. But anyways, uh, this thing's very loud. There's three layers of deadener around the whole cab, so uh, there's no rattles or anything like that. Um, honestly, I'd rather have this truck than the new one, and the reason why is because this truck runs so great I've never had any problems with it I've always kept it freshened up everything the suspension the engine the whole drivetrain everything I've always kept it freshened up um, all the way through the time that I've owned it I've I've uh, kept things clean kept things freshened up so uh, so it's a hell of a truck I haven't put 24s on it or anything like that because uh, I myself am uh, I'm a very busy person and uh, if I had 24s on here, I'd just wreck them. So I, uh, once in a while, I ride up on a curb and stuff like that. So you definitely can't be doing that with fours or sixes. So, um, but and also this thing rides like a Cadillac. I mean, I really enjoy the way it rides. I can hit a, I can hit dips and stuff like that. You know, doing 60 no problem. And it, uh, this truck handles everything well. Uh, definitely rides very good not a leak not a tick not a sound i mean this truck is very uh very good truck i really hate to see it go uh but i'm gonna sell it to continue this next build um but even if i don't sell it i got enough cubes in here uh as you can see i'll go ahead and open it up real quick as you can see i can still go all the way to the back wall here and uh and also kerf this and get some more cubes i could pull about 30 cubes uh for those 18s right there ported so that shouldn't be a problem so the build's going to happen one way or another i'm not worried about it either way i got other money coming in so uh, uh it's no skin off my neck either way so um but i really didn't want to tear this system apart so but if i gotta tear it apart i'll tear it apart sell it Put it in my wife's car or something but uh but we're definitely gonna get this next build done you'll see and uh just wanted to show you it is going down and it's going slow a little bit slower than i've expected uh but nonetheless it is happening and i just wanted to say special thanks to scott everybody at ascent and audio thank you very much uh these things are beautiful man they turned out great um very majestic I'm very impressed with these and uh, also thank you to Steven with uh, DFG Audio um, for those of you who don't know who that is 
He's the one that gave Steve Mead a demo out here in his truck when, when Steve was out here at the Palms. Um, he definitely knows what he's doing, and, uh, and I just want to say thank you, Stephen, for making this deal happen. And, uh, and stay tuned. This build's going to happen, and uh, I'll get some more videos out there. All right?